Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Today we're talking to Yuko. Huh? Mouthwatering? What are you talking about? This is our client, Yuko Kamashiro. Hmm, now then, Miss Kamashiro, what matters of, of case brings you to us? Okay, I want you to investigate my father. Hmm? Chapter 5, the search continue, Yuko Kamashiro. You did level 4. You mean Mr. Satoru Kamashiro, the former president of Kamashiro Enterprises? Yes. He passed away last year. It was reported to have been a suicide, correct? No, that isn't true. My father would never kill himself. Hmm. Oh, I'm sorry for the outburst. No, there's nothing to apologize for. But why do we believe he wouldn't do it? Do you have some proof that he wasn't suicidal? Uh, I, no, I don't. That's exactly why I've come to you. I see, that makes sense. If you want clues, then you may want to start with Makato Yamashina, whom I had you investigate the other day. He was a researcher for Kamashiro until last year. He left the company around the same time my father died, and then he disappeared. So you believe Yamashina is connected to your father's death in some way? Yes. Even if there's no direct connection, I'm certain he must know something about my father's death. Hmm, so you had us investigate Makato Yamashima as a prelude to this case, then. That was the way of testing us. Since you've brought another case to us, that implies that we passed your test. I apologize, there are so few people around me who I can trust. Uh, I'm very sorry for my uh, little ruse. Ha! <laughs> I have such an honest answer as proof that we have earned your trust. <laughs> we shall investigate your father's death. Th thank you so much, thank you so much. Oh, please excuse me for a moment. Hello, yes? No, no, there's no problem. Yes, yes, what? No, no, I'm alone. I understand. I'll be right back. Please wait at the head office, Miss Rio. Goodbye. I'm sorry, something came up all of a sudden. So it appears. Ple so it appears. Please leave the investigation to us. Thank you very much. Goodbye for now. This could turn out to be a really big case. We've got to go all out and solve it. If it all goes well, we could expose Kamashiro's past along with the company's inner workings. I should ask Detective Matayoshi for his help. Alright, let's get started on the case. I'll go over in the info on Makato Yamashima again. While I'm doing that, I want you to take, go back out at his home and pay him another visit. I don't know if we'll get anywhere near, new, anything new, but, well, NVNG, I guess. NVNG, hmm? No, sorry, never mind, it's nothing important. NVNG, it's something my father used to say a lot. It's an abbreviation for nothing ventured, nothing gained. My father said something different, though. Something mentioned, something gained. I always thought it should be abbreviated as SVFG, but it's a rather elegant and refined expression, don't you think? Well, no need to think too deeply on it, that would be in uh, inelegant. Okay, enough of the chit chat. Get on the case for me. Hey, what kind of uh, things do you like? I don't really know a lot about you. Oh, so many things. I thought you talk to each other. <laughs> I thought it wasn't going to let me do it for a minute there. Apparently Renamon's ready to digivolve, let's go see her. Digivolve. Up. Oh, Renamon. What can you become? Platomon. Renamon. Your actual thing. Um, let's become... Let's become your actual thing, because that's not too annoying to do. Cubimon, I believe. Yep. There you go. Lovely. What's her max level? Where did it say that? Um, I don't know. Well, there we go, anyway. Ooh. Oh, max level 45. That doesn't seem right. Oh, I suppose because it started as a champion, didn't it? Oh well. There we go, that's done. We're still unable to go back into that thing. Yeah. That really sucks. I wanted to get more training. 
There's so many Digimon that we've kind of met now as well, but on the upside, Digimon that we kind of met are useful because we can de-digivolve into them. As long as we've encountered them. Oh, I went too far. Anyway, let's go look about Thingy's dad by talking to this dude. You're a stubborn one. How many times do I have to tell you? I don't know any Kamashiro. You're asking if I never heard of them? The first I heard of them was from you. No, it was before that. On the news, I think. Wait, no. Maybe I heard it from my daughter? I don't know. Ask my daughter. Ask Chica. I need to lie down. I suddenly feel dizzy. Chica! She said she was going to Shibuya, I believe. A new single from a band was going to be available for a limited time at Tower Records. Jimmy Kin? No, that wasn't it. You really must excuse me. Let's go to Tower Records in Shibuya. We talk to Yam uh, Yamashiro's daughter, Chika. She's a chicken. Or was she a duck, Chika? I guess she was a chicken, because it would make sense. Well, that guy's got crazy hair. Oh ho, so you actually noticed me here. Good job. I am Victory Yoshida. My dream is to become CEO. I feel like you have what it takes to make it big, too. I'll give it this to show my respect. Ninja USB. Think you can find me again? I'll be waiting for you to victory. Well, that's cool. What does a Victory USB do? And then she's been always successful escape from battle. I don't really need to use that, do I? Where's the girl? There she is. You say you have questions again? We just want to be left alone. Well, what is it now? What? About my dad? There's not very much to say. Uh, hmm, until recently my dad was a workaholic, he didn't even come home on his days off. But he seemed to change more recently. His focus shifted to taking care of his family. Sorry, everyone. I'm not sure why exactly. Maybe something changed with his work? Before, I know... Uh, before, I know he worked for a place called the Nile Corporation, but... Shouldn't you be on your way? I don't have much free time either. Can I go now? How did it go? Getting useful clues? Hmm, the Nile Corporation. I hadn't thought there'd be a connection there. The Nile Corporation. I passed across before. Detective Matayoshi looked into the company once before. My father was involved in that investigation too. They were following up on a hunch, apparently. Okay, look into the Nile Corporation for me. You might be able to get some info at the Corporation Pavilion near the Eden entrance. I'll look into the case files that my father and Detective Matayoshi put together back then. Alright, I'm counting on you. Got the keyword Nile Corporation. To the Corporation Pavilion near Eden entrance. Um, okay. Thank you very much for your work on the case. Leave it to me. If you don't like Jimmy Kin's song, just don't think about him, that's all. Is it daytime over there? It's night here. I want all over our collection data. Good job today, Mum. Come on then, off we go to Eden. Near the Eden entrance, it said. There's a person up there with a key, so let's go talk to them. Oh, there's loads of people up here with keys, actually. It'd be awfully nice if my kids could also work at a big company like Kamashiro. Now, Corporation has a company created to research the Eden avatar system, isn't it? I think they were bought out by some big company a long time ago, though. They aren't around anymore. Better head back to the office. Well, that was easy. That one man knew it all. Come on in, back to the office we go. Woo! Am I ever going to unlock new places, or is it always going to be Kowloon? Forever. I know I go to other weird bits. Actually, I should see if I can go to some of those other places via this. No, it's only those two forever that I can go for some reason. Oh well. Bit of a shame that I can't go to the other places. I guess it expects me to 
grind around a bit more when I go to places like that, if I want to get in modern stuff like that. Oh well. Here we are. Oh, hello, yeah, young assistant. Are you getting used to working as a detective? What's with that look? You're looking at me like I'm not supposed to be here. Kyo-chan, can you tell why I'm here? Well, something strange has happened, and we can't find the Nara Corporation case files. So I thought I'd ask someone directly involved with the case itself. Of course you didn't find them. All the files are stored together at Kamashiro. At Kamashiro? I'm ashamed to have to admit this, but we had to leave the files there. <gasps> This was that hunch of yours, isn't it? Yes. At the time, suspicions were raised that Kamashiro had acquired the Nile Corporation... something. Your father and I were investigating that when we ran into a little problem. A problem? Pressure, pressure came down from up top. We were forced to abandon the case. At the time, we were also forced to hand over all case files to Kamashiro, too. So Kamashiro pulled the strings. That was a self-incriminating move, wasn't it? That was the implied understanding. Since we know how bad it was, we decided to keep silent track of where the case files were stored. I kept track even after your father passed away. Now the files are being stored deep within the Avalon server, which is the main Kamashiro server. I'm sure it's in the part of the cyberspace Kamashiro employs called the Confidential Database. And when I say I've kept track, it's not like I've confirmed the data's location firsthand. At best, it's conjecture based on info from scans on the environs. Call it my intuition. Hmm, that's good, good enough for me. Well, then I say it's about time we had them return what they've been keeping from us. Listen to me, Kyo-chan. This is Kamashiro we're dealing with. How do you plan to get around the high top notch security of a world-renowned company? Let's learn from the case of the robbing rooster. We don't... We don't force our way through a closed gate. Instead, we employ a strategy and have them open it for us. Whoa, hey now, is that even possible? A good detective makes it impossible possible. What, we already have a rooster of our own uh, lined up. Someone who can crow in just the way we need. And we'll get hit her to help us when it comes to infiltrating Kamashiro. Aha, speak of the devil. Begging your pardon. Oh. Hehe, <laughs> once again you've arrived right on time. This is my client, Yugo Kamashiro. Um, has there been any progress? Yugo Kamashiro? You don't mean the former president's... I see, no one would have questioned her if she were to walk into the Corporation HQ. What? I... who is this? Young lady, we need your assistance, please. Huh? What? What? Huh? What? I see. What do you say? We really need your help with the investigation. That's fine, I want to know if my suspicions are correct as well, after all. Uh -huh. Aha. But I am a miner, and such my f but I am a miner, and such my authority with the company is rather restricted. I doubt I'll be able to do much more than get you into the lobby of the main office. Let me think about it. If I were inviting friends from school to take a tour, I shouldn't be an issue getting you into today. I think it'd be hard passing me and Kyo-chan off as your friends. Worst case, they might recognise us too. Hmm. So as long as you'd get my assistant in, that would be terrific. Could you manage that? But then, how do we get to the confidential database? Do you have some means of doing that? Even if your assistant were a world-class hacker, I doubt it's even possible. Yeah, let's do that. Well, there we have it, Yuko. Leave the domain of cyber living to us. Very well, I'll go and get things set up. What are you actually going to do, Kyo-chan? To get in, I have an idea, actually. Oh-ho! Uh -huh. There was this case once where I got my hands on a little program. I'm thinking of having it customized for my assistance with the help of someone I know. Shall we get started with the preparations? My dear assistant, start by heading to Murray Murakaragi's place. I'll let her know you're coming and why you can get the details from her. Let her someone who's safe for this fence get back early yourself. Um. We try to do a dreadful task, you return once if you get too dangerous, no need to worry. Off we go to visit Murray. Hey, is it true you're taking a break from school? Sounds like tons of fun. But of all the detective work, it's keeping me pretty busy. 
My preparations are complete. Go ahead, take this program. <gasps> you got the hacking skills, stealth hide. Ah, oh, no, it's a hacking skills program repurposed from the Baku program Kyoko gave me. By using this, you'll be able to almost perfectly mask your account information. Effectively, you'll be invisible. <gasps> Given your half cyber body, you should be able to use that skill not only in cyberspace, but in the real world as well. This skill should potentially be used for a wide variety of crimes. But given your deepening bond with Digimon, I trust you won't use it for evil purposes. Hmm. That was rhetorical, dear. I see all. You're a cyber sleuth, no? Someday you must expose my secrets. Okay, I got in touch with Kyoko. Hmm, things went well it seems. I'm sure you have many questions, but start by focusing on the relevant case. I heard from Yuka Kamishiro earlier, and you've been invited to Kamishiro Corporate HQ. Hmm, access this URL to access an account with privileges to the corporate office. The privileges are limited to the lobby, but that should be enough to let you get in without too much problem. No trouble. We've had our rooster crow, now to set the fox loose in the hen house. You've gotten some handy hacking skills, I know, but you'll need to think on your feet in them. Be the wolf in the sheep's clothing. It'll take all your cunning, skill, bravery to sneak on in and waltz out of the grand prize. Also, for the record, Detective Matayoshi isn't involved in, involved with obtaining and using the hacking skills for this case. Keep that in mind. Now then, let's get this job done. Anyway, guess I'd better follow this corporate tour you will to Kamishiro Corporate Heart Heart's Q. Even with some useful hacking skills, play it by ear and proceed with caution. Oh, I keep kneeling on papers. Go away. There we go. It's really annoying, you can't just jump straight from the thing to Eden unless I'm doing something wrong. Here we go. Oh. Do, 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 do. You're so late. I got exhausted just waiting for you. Huh? It's gonna be that girl, isn't it? Oh no, it's her. You're so late. I got ultra super worried. Oh, not that I was worried about you, see? Don't get the wrong idea or anything. Hmm. Uh, my man, I need to pretend that you're my friend here. Just follow my lead, alright? <laughs> Is there uh, anything that matter with that? You can pretend to be my friend, right? A school friend, a normal friend, friend? Hmm, that's odd. Were the files I dug up on friendship mistaken? What? You want to act like I normally do? I'm not so, uh, not sure I quite get what you're saying. If that's true, then you and I are already friends after a fashion, no? Hmm. Okay, I see that was just a joke that fell flat, right? That was part of the plan, right, Merman? Things got a little too real for you there. I forgot to let myself play along. What I mean is you've done your homework. I seem to have misjudged you. Anyway, welcome to Kamashiro. Okay, let's pretend to tour the lobby. I'll pretend to show you around. What? You're going to strike out on your own? But what's your actual plan for getting in? What? How did the person just vanish? Both the avatar and the account info. Oh my, Miss Yuko, where has your friend gotten off to? What? My, my friend has, um... Well, uh, playing hide-and-seek. What? Hide-and-seek? Yes, that's right. Is there some problem? No, no problem, per se. This is the perfect place for hide-and-seek. It's so spacious. I, I suppose it is, sure. There certainly is a lot of space here. By the way, I'm... Oh, well then. Good luck, I guess. Uh, oh, she's it. Thank you. I'm going to find my friend. Just you watch. That's the spirit. <laughs> well then, give it your best shot. Say hello to your friend for me. He says hello. A program that seals an account and it requires Digimon program hacking skills, which is completely illegal, I'll point out. But you and Kyoko did say that cyber sleuthing was your area of expertise, so that's reassuring. When you're finished, meet me here and we'll leave together. Please try not to take too long. There's a limit to the time we can spend pretending to play hide and seek. I'll see you later then. Maybe you should come up with a better cover up story. Kyoko told me to think on my feet. But I don't see any place to connect jump into. Let me look around. Go invisible so you cannot be detected by others. Your account info will be hidden so you can investigate without leaving a trace. You're Miss Yuko's friend. Please enjoy yourself. Why is she in a box? Welcome to Eden Headquarters of Kamishira Enterprises. Just cause you're friendly with the old prisoner's door doesn't mean you can snoop around the place. Employees only. Get it? 
Hmm, it's hard sucking up to Miss Cashier Bay. I mean, I'm running out of things to talk about. Oh dear. I've complimented her looks, her style, her ability. Age sounds like a bad idea. That's it. If I can get a hold of her personal files, I could come up with even more creative uh, artistic compliments. Wait, no, those are probably top secret. Even if I could access the Avalon server, I don't have the security clearance to get the details. What's left, personality? I wonder if I could find something nice to say. Ugh. Why are you still talking? Hmm, you couldn't find the link to the server on the terminal? Ah, service access rights are linked to each employee's avatar. The terminals have nothing to do with it. Meaning the avatars themselves are the links. The avatars are the links? I'd better check the avatars of some commissioner employees. If I just look at avatars, I'll get suspicious. I'd better use still stealth hide the sneak. Anyway, we are going to call that a day for this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, like and subscribe. And I will see you hopefully next week when we get sleuthing into the Kamashiro building. See you later. Bye-bye.